going to try a bit of bullet, although I don't think I should be playing the bullet just now. I've not actually done any warm-up matches, but I'm just going to flip in. My fingers aren't warmed up. <laughs> I can tell straight off. Castle. Uh, yeah. Gotta warm the fingers up. <laughs> They're not moving. Oh, at least we got them thinking for a few seconds, although underneath was time wise now. But this position is rubbish. <laughs> My fingers weren't moving fast enough. What's it? Wake them up. So this might be a problem for us because they're probably thinking of some tactic. Um, let's go here. Just trying to get this dark square bishop to breathe, it's all stuck in here. Let's attack the knight. Maybe come in here to come here to attack the queen. Let's go here, like we said. Don't want to overthink it, give my king some company as well. This rook's obviously our queen, so we need to be mindful of that. Uh, oh, you see, it's messing everything up. So we take. Oh, he's on our night. Oh, totally messed it up. Totally messed it up. Give me strength. I knew they were thinking tactically, the speed at which they're moving, and I still fell for it. Ah, oh, dear. What? Doing it again. It's doing it again in the dying seconds. Isn't that annoying? Oosh, we went on time. <sighs> Unbelievable. You gotta watch these tactical players that take long over the moves and Yeah. This player was finding quite a few of those little tactical type maneuvers but positionally we seemed to be okay we were blocking things off we ended up being a minor piece down in this situation but it goes to show again as we always say 
doesn't matter how many pieces you've got on the board, if they're not in the right places, then they're tantamount to being useless. So really is a key factor is that just find those good positions and especially in these bullet type things, unbelievable. Yeah, good game.